everyone, welcome back to my channel. I feel like <laughs> you have no idea what <laughs> kind of bumpiness we've been through. But I feel like it's been forever since I made a video and it's because it has. I haven't filmed since March and it's kind of been nice during quarantine to kind of take a break as a family and have some fun family time and whatnot. But Trent and I have some news for you. <laughs> <laughs> I, can't, I can't film because it's so dang bumpy. No, it's not the news you're thinking. We are not expecting. No. Um, we are actually in a very bumpy moving truck right now because we're moving. Like no one can ever keep up with us anymore because that's probably true. We've moved um, five times in four years of being married, right? I'm trying to count all the addresses we've had. Address since this is our married. sixth address. But for anyone who knows us, we moved out of state two years ago now to Texas and spent nearly a year there and then we came back and now um, to California and to, now we're going to drum roll to Denver, Colorado. <laughs> So we are on our way to Denver. We had to bring along our horse Shirley, so we had to find a whole transportation that took a three day long journey for her. We really needed to bring her, she's an amazing horse, and needed to leave and find a home for a while to um, live in. And then we finally went back and my sister is watching the kids while we get to just be in a moving truck for 18 hours together so that's always good but <laughs> we're super excited and wanted to share with you guys kind of our journey along the road in way and letting you guys know that we are officially Coloradans <laughs> is that what you say? I don't know. We're Coloradans. Yeah. So we're super excited and just wanted to keep you guys all in the know so when I start filming again it's going to be like where, it's not going to be like where is in and Trent now. We are in Colorado officially. We are currently like three hours away. We're on our final stretch. We stayed the night in a random town in Wyoming um, which was cute, tiny. They didn't even have a Starbucks so I'm a little a little sad because I have. That's, that's how Hannah measures the, uh, the livability of a town is, is there a Chipotle and is there a Starbucks? True story. We are now a few hours away from the border of Colorado. We are moving, I should probably say where, we're moving to Castle Rock in Colorado which is, uh, I believe it's, it's a southern south. southern suburb yeah. of Denver. It's south, kind of on the way to Colorado Springs. We kind of like a little bit of a slower pace, more country, and having the city and whatnot close by and where my sister lives. So it's all going to be super exciting and a new adventure for our family and Trent's um, work brought us here. So we're just super blessed and grateful to be able to go on these journeys and experiences as a family. So family. <laughs> But anyway, I wanted to keep you guys in the know. I'm super excited to start filming again and just kind of making it a positive environment since I know with COVID going on, I just kind of wanted to take a break since I know there wasn't a lot to do and everyone was kind of adjusting to a new lifestyle, including myself with kids' schools and with just a changed routine. And now I think I might have to homeschool Ella this year. It's a whole other story to come. We'll see. <laughs> but I hope you guys are all doing well and all staying safe. Sorry, the sun is really bright in my eyes now. <laughs> but I love you all and I'm excited to be showing you more of Colorado. But yep, that's the news. No babies here. I know everyone's thinking that we're always popping them out, but I think we're we're, done. we're feeling it. We're I feeling think. We're, no, definitely no. I, uh, there comes to be a point people say when you know that you are done with having kids. 
I think our sanity is at maximum. We love our kids, but one more and I think we'd lose it completely. Yep. So don't ever expect that from us. And if you ever get that from us, it's gonna be an oh wow situation. So we're probably gonna take all the uh, precautions in that way pretty quick here on his end. So right? Bye, guys. Talk to you soon. Where's the gas? Damn it.